Take a deep breath in. And as you breathe in, breathe in a wonderful feeling of calm and relaxation. And as you exhale, feel a gentle wave of relaxation, perhaps starting at the top of your head and working down, or maybe from the tips of your toes or tips of your fingers, rippling inwards with a wave of relaxation. And when you breathe in, breathe in not just relaxation, but a feeling of wonder, of curiosity, of intrigue. As you start to imagine becoming so small that you would get to experience your body from the inside. Like an old fashioned movie being shrunk down and then exploring the body from the inside to see cells and internal organs. So as you breathe in and breathe out, hold two opposing thoughts simultaneously. That you are both shrinking down to a microscopic level and able to access your physical body as if exploring a different entity. Feel yourself becoming deeper and deeper relaxed as you imagine as I count downwards from 10 to 1 you will imagine becoming deeper and deeper relaxed but also smaller and smaller and smaller until you become microscopic. 10, just feeling a wave of relaxation. That's it, releasing any tension. 9, noticing in particular tension being released around your jaw, around your mouth, nostrils. That's it, 9 becomes 8, and now focus on your forehead as that becomes deeper and more relaxed, smoothening and softening the muscles, more and more relaxed. And then seven, that wave of relaxation now in your neck and your shoulders, and six, all the way down, down your arms. Arms feeling limp, loose and heavy. As you imagine your whole world getting smaller, and smaller and smaller as you breathe in feel your lungs relaxing your heart relaxing that's it and then four even your gut releasing any anxiety legs feeling more relaxed three and then two just shrinking all the way down And I want you to imagine, as you get smaller and smaller and smaller, you can see a small robotic suit. Something like Iron Man. Or perhaps a miniature robot that you can climb inside. Two and then one deeper relaxed. And this is a tiny microscopic robot capable of navigating anywhere in the human body. And then one that's it deeper and deeper relaxed, so small. And imagine climbing into this robotic suit, pulling down a helmet or visor, and accepting the suggestion that you can now navigate a human body 
safely and giving you the ability in the same way that someone navigating through space could explore the unknown, you could explore the human body from within. And then imagine you're in that suit and maybe it has propulsion and you can move to the relevant part of your physical body where you can safely enter maybe the mouth or nostril and just imagine being so small you can explore the human body from within I want you to imagine you're experiencing not just the body from the inside but what the body does when it's forced to adapt through a period called fasting the voluntarily and efficient way of adapting the body through simply deciding not to eat. I want you to imagine perhaps you might start swimming through the blood and initially seeing all of the sugar in the blood known as glycogen and for the first few hours of perhaps a three or four day fast you could imagine that that glycogen in the blood is all the body needs to have energy to not need food but as you experience a human body that refuses to snack and misses several meals in a row meaning that after perhaps 12 or even 14 hours or more you notice that the body is starting to run out of that glycogen and therefore through necessity the body starts to open a vault almost like there's an invisibility blanket hiding all of the body fat cells up to this point but at the point where glycogen runs low the invisibility blanket over the body fat cells is lifted at which point the body then realizes that it can convert that stored energy almost like every body fat cell is like a battery energy that can be utilized when needed with the invisibility blanket lifted the body starts activating these fat cells turning the fats into ketones and allowing there to be a different form of energy but of course the body feels hungry because the body is used to having fuel through food and hasn't yet adapted to all of this energy stored in these body fat cells. Imagine going through time, perhaps another four, five, six hours, and through the visor of the suit, seeing so many more of these ketones flooding through the body, giving energy to muscles, to the brain. I want you to get a sense that this adaptation 
is good for the body. And then perhaps, the most important thing that you're about to witness may come more than 24 hours after the fast starts. Something that scientists would be calling autophagy. But I want you to witness and see it as something different. Not just a name of a biological process, but the body's ability to initiate a spring cleaning system at the cellular level. That after 24 hours without food, when the glycogen has run dry, when the body's got used to feeding on ketones, the energy converted from body fat, notice the spring cleaning system within the body start to be initiated. Almost like an army of microscopic cleaners looking for cells that are no longer useful for the body. Maybe, maybe these are cells that are perhaps folded. Perhaps dead cells. The spring cleaning system you could imagine as a cellular self-eating system, a recycling cleanup process that rids the body of damaged and misfolded proteins. But the lack of food is what requires this process because the well-fed cell isn't worried about being efficient. It doesn't need to recycle its components. In a well-fed state, your cells and their components are highly acetylated. The various molecules in the cells, including those packaging proteins, the ones called histones that wrap your DNA up nicely. They're decorated. Decorated with this acetyl. And I want you to get a sense that what's happening really is that the well-fed cell has many genes including those associated with cellular survival. And while your cells turn on cellular growth, and peripheration genes when you aren't fasting, They also turn other genes off. And these include genes related to fat metabolism, stress resistance and damage repair. But during starvation, things are very different. When your body reacts to what it sees as an environmental stress of you choosing there to be low food availability, the genes start to adapt. And this lack of food program kicks your cell into a completely different state. In this time, 
these cells go into self-protective mode, activating autophagy and fat breakdown. Just imagine this army of spring cleaning cells investigating almost every cell in your body searching for those damaged misfolded proteins and cells and recycling them into energy or useful proteins so as you explore the body from the inside maybe you could imagine your body as a self-cleaning oven burning away impurities and leaving you feeling renewed and energized. Start to see your cells cleaning themselves, removing all of the unwanted debris and recycling it into valuable energy. You might not be eating, but every sip of water you take fuels the autophagy process enhancing your body's natural ability to heal and regenerate so feel the excitement of knowing that with each passing hour your body is getting cleaner and healthier as you explore the body from the inside, see the damaged parts of your cells being cleared away, making room for new, healthy growth. And you can see the transformation happening within you as your body efficiently recycles old materials into new, vibrant energy. It's having an impact on the brain. As from the inside, you can see the increasing clarity and focus that comes from having a body free of cellular debris and toxins. Visualize yourselves glowing with health as they undergo this powerful self-cleaning process. Feel the deep satisfaction of knowing that your commitment to make this choice to be without food for a certain period of time is actually allowing your body to perform at its best. As you can see, each cell in your body becoming more efficient, like a well-oiled machine, thanks to this process of autophagy. See yourself becoming stronger and more resilient as your body removes old damaged cells and replaces them with new ones. Imagine how you would feel if someone came into your home and replaced anything damaged or old with brand new furniture, televisions, technology. And imagine that similar process taking place within your own body. Feel the surge of energy and vitality that comes from giving your body the chance to heal itself naturally. See the pathways in your body clearing, allowing for better flow of energy and nutrients. As you imagine your immune system becoming stronger and more effective, as it benefits from the cleaning process happening within you. From this point on, you will imagine your body as a self-sustaining system, 
constantly renewing and repairing itself through the power of autophagy. And all it takes is two or three days without food. Triggering the very process that can increase mental clarity and give you more emotional balance that comes from a body free of unnecessary clutter and toxins. Start to see your cells working harmoniously, each one doing its part to keep you healthy and vibrant. Imagine the sense of accomplishment and pride that you'll feel as you stay committed to this process where you allow the cleaning to continue, knowing the incredible benefits it brings. And maybe it won't be long until you look at yourself in the mirror where you see your skin glowing with health and radiance, knowing that your body has had a spring clean from the inside, replacing old damaged cells, giving you a feeling of rejuvenation and vitality. Feel the lightness and ease in your body as it continues to cleanse and renew itself because you can visualize the clean, efficient energy flowing through you, powering every aspect of your life. And then imagine you're still in your body when the next phase takes place. After two days of being without food, the body starts to release human growth hormone, giving you the ability to feel stronger, healing your body from perhaps old injuries. Observe this process taking place from the inside, while simultaneously feeling the deep inner peace that comes from knowing you are taking excellent care of your health, vitality and body. As you start to imagine the long-term benefits of this fast, with your body continuing to thrive and stay healthy well into the future. Because this isn't about having two or three days without food and then Going back to old habits of snacking on unhealthy foods. What if this fast was like a biological reset, giving you a window that when you break the fast, you give yourself nutritious, delicious food to build new habits, reducing a desire for snacking, and increasing a desire for healthy, natural, whole foods. Foods filled with natural fibers, proteins. Food that is powered by sunshine and rainwater. What if this wasn't two or three days and then back to normal? What if this was two or three days that trains your body to naturally desire to continue a trajectory of health and vitality. Imagine that there is a control room somewhere in your body and seek it out. See a control panel and just decide to increase confidence levels, increase feelings of self-worth, increase your motivation and 
decrease stress, anxiety, and worries, but also decrease your resting appetite just enough so that you will desire to eat less in your future, giving your body only what you need for optimal health and vitality. And then imagine leaving this body in this microscopic robotic suit and feel that you're leaving the suit and returning back to your normal size but no longer as a separate entity you are returning to your normal size feeling committed to any fasting or health choices you make feeling that your body knows what is healthy and useful and beneficial for your body. Take a deep breath in through your nose and out through your nose. Wiggle your fingers, wiggle your toes, connect fully with the present moment and as I count from 1 to 10 you will feel back at your normal size in the present moment in your physical body feeling healthy committed and full of vitality knowing that your body is cleaning itself from the inside at a cellular level starting to count one two three waking up four five six more alert seven eight open your eyes open your eyes nine ten wide awake wide awake wide awake